Hello guys, I'm here at the Christmas tree. Um, there were a bunch of what I consider to be uh, non-credible reports that some shenanigans are going to go down here. But figured to come out and check it out anyways. I'm low tech, just the phone, no gimbal, no mics, no extra batteries, just the phone. So. Gonna walk around the tree for a little bit, check things out. Lots of families out here, little kids just enjoying the tree and checking things out. It's like old world Portland. Got what looks like to be another streamer right there. Very nice, very nice. Remember when I was a little boy, there wasn't all this like uh, <laughs> hatred between different groups. I mean, Christians or people that celebrate or culturally follow Christian traditions have been the majority in America. And that was never looked down upon. If you weren't a Christian, you didn't hate the Christians for celebrating Christmas. You didn't hate the Africans for celebrating Kwanzaa or the Jews for Hanukkah and the Muslims for, I don't know, the, uh, the Muslim holiday that's at the new year. But uh, everybody just did their thing and they respected each other. But, uh, I loved Christmas when I was a little kid. Not just the presents, just uh, the fun and magic of it. Two weeks off from school, all the Christmas movies, different cookies and food, vacations and visiting people. This is kind of a nice little moment here where Portland's acting like it used to be. It used to be there'd be a whole, whole swaths of people down here. Swaths, swaths of people down here. <laughs> he, look, he looks a little nippy. But uh, it's nice just seeing people out here just coming to enjoy something together in the city without hate and nastiness, at least at, at this point yet. Oh, I hope they didn't burn it down. It's part of me that wants them to burn it down because then they will be forever um, branded with bad PR as the, Grinch, the Grinches that stole Christmas. Like they will literally have stolen Christmas. That's a beautiful sight, huh, guys? Nice looking sight there. Yeah, I'm enjoying it. Starting to find myself enjoying the small moments a lot. <laughs> the, the protest llama, I remember that last summer. Let's keep walking around a little bit. These trees down here, the Christmas Tree Village. This is where the uh, Trimets sell, the main place where they sell their bus passes. Christmas land. This is probably my favorite view right here, right now.
Got a dude there, with the vest on, some bear mace on his chest. Don't know what that's about. Friend or foe, don't know. People are starting to gather. How you doing? You just out here filming the tree or are you filming Patriots? Uh, I'm villain report. Okay. You're a Patriot? Yeah, I, you've actually talked to me on, on there. I was the one that asked you to chill out with the, uh, some, of the, some of your comments and you're like, nah. About the police? Oh, about COVID? Yeah. Okay, I remember that. Yeah. Yeah, I understand some people have had some hard times with COVID, yeah. and, and I understand that, but uh, I, I just can't. Uh, yeah. well, I it's crazy what's happening from. in the world because of that. It's not, yeah. yeah. Okay, well, man. My friend just wanted me to come down and see who you're with and everything just to make sure. Yeah. Because yeah. we're not in the mood for anyone's shit no more. Yeah, I don't, I don't know if it was a credible thing. They didn't look very credible to me, but I thought, I thought I'd come down anyways and see what, what happens. Well, we're down here, so. Yeah. Is, um, did you see the guy with the, uh, the white uh, 4K camera on his chest here? Uh, no, but I can, is, is, you see the same one that I keep? I don't know. If he keeps following me, I'm gonna press harassment on him. Yeah, I, I've never seen him before. I don't know, I don't know if he is. And I'm famous, so I should know who they are. <laughs> You're famous, huh? Yeah, from that fucking spot over there. Yeah? You've probably seen it. I haven't, I haven't. I don't oh, watch streams. When stream I got escorted by a feds. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. I don't watch streams, actually. It's ironic, because I... Well, I, it's on Andy Knows thing. Yeah? Yeah, it was from a couple weeks ago. Oh, wow. So... It's pretty peaceful down here so far. Yeah. I kind of found... I kind of feel like they're either just trolling us, or... They're, they're probably preparing for something. Or they're, so, like. or they're somewhere else. Yeah. yeah. I feel like they're preparing for something. Yeah. Because they only go to a certain areas. Yeah. So, well, yeah. that's the guy I was talking about. You talking to me? Yeah. Why don't you fucking go home, piece of shit? Why are you out here? Because it's my city. I can be out here. It's a fucking free country. <laughs> Drama starting. Got the streamer up there. I do have an Antifa streamer up there, so hopefully, I don't know if he's Antifa or not, I just know he's a, I just know he's a sketchy. How are you doing, Audra? Pretty good. I didn't know it was you. Yeah. So who are you just yelling at? That, this, that this gentleman there at the black hole. No I clue. Hi. I recognize him. How are you doing? Good. What brings you back today? None of my business. That's not very loving. <laughs> 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 Audra going up to talk to Audra. Cops Northwest going up to talk to uh, the, the assumed Antifa streamer. I guess I'll go up there and stream too. First of all, I didn't even see the post. I originally came out to see what's going on with Rat Ribs. Yeah, so they put a post out online. I was pretty sure it was trolling, but a bunch of the so-called patriot crowd said they're gonna come out here. So I figured, come out and see the Christmas tree and hang out with some of my people that I know. And if they show up, they show up, and if they don't, they don't. Yeah, I just want to come and check out the tree, really. Oh, really? Yeah. Just into the Christmas spirit? 
Well, that and uh, I'm going to another event in a little bit. I like how oh, yeah. his story flips so quickly. Yeah. 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 It's local here. We're filming dumbass right wingers. Is there going to be. Oh, now I'm filming the tree. Protest, or is it? It's uh, for uh, like it's a uh, thing. Let me pull it up. I'll tell you what it was. I'll take a look at your camera if that's okay. I've been looking at that one. Is it working out pretty good for you? The Yeah, it's the Sony. It's got the built-in image stabilization, so it's really nice. Where'd you get that uh, little sh backpack mount thing? Uh, this is a shoulder mount, and then it goes to a live view solo. A live view? Yeah. You're, you're, you've got your own live view set up? Yeah. So it's like a little like computer setup back there, kind of? Yeah, exactly. Yeah? Do you stream? Yeah, I do. I'm streaming right now. What the? I haven't looked into. I've heard of the live view. A couple of people are talking about that, but I haven't uh, checked it out yet. Cool, man. I was just thinking about getting that. It's uh, the. Everybody says to get that instead of the GoPro. I'm pretty upset with the GoPro. It kind of sucks. It just says we're honoring indigenous, but uh, the GoPro is cool, but it doesn't have the built-in stabilization. It has um, digital stabilization. Yeah. Um, and this, this camera's old though. They haven't came out with a new one in a while. Uh-huh. But it's still like the best one. There's a bigger one that looks like that, like how it's uh, taller than it is skinny. Yeah. Um, there's one that's uh, as, as wide it is as tall. So I don't know if that, that's the same one or... The Sony or... Uh, yeah. Sony only, there's a Sony AS300 and an FDR X3000. Huh. That's this one. I think they're pretty much the same. How much is the, uh, the little... I've never seen it, so I don't know what it looks like, but the little live view setup you have in your backpack. Uh, it's like a, it's like a little kind of like pie or laptop kind of mixture. Yeah, kind of. It's like a live view. It's got a uh, supports modems and HD monitor camera. Huh. When you get near, have you been at an event near a um, a uh, mainstream media news crew? Oh yeah, yeah. Filming with they, with they your live view. Live views. Yeah. Do were you did your uh, f um, feed stay up while you were close to them? Hey, how you doing, man? It does, yeah. I got yeah. I got multiple modems. Cause uh, I've heard that those uh, the reason why a lot of times your your regular live streams start yeah. dipping yeah. down when you get too close to new, news crews because they're using live view and it sucks up the bandwidth. Oh, that, I got an APC and the Verizon. Oh yeah. I think I I mean like I'm completely like politically opposite to you, but uh -huh. I think it's funny. Um, there's this one guy. I'm actually who, pretty middle of the road. Everybody tries to pick me, but I'm, <laughs> I'm pretty middle of the road. The, you know, um, back in like June or July, you got like chased into a hotel or something? Yeah. That same guy. Miami, yeah, he knocked. Was that, are you the one that yeah, got knocked out? He, he fucking oh, knocked out dude. Eyes <laughs> dude, that Miami guy is crazy, man. Yeah. Dude, did you get a look in his eyes when he came up to you? Yeah. Dude, his eyes freaked me out. There's like no soul in there. I yeah, it was terrible. Yeah, I was pretty mad for you. I don't care if you got different bleeds from me. Like, I, I was pretty mad that he he knocked you out too, dude. That uh, well, I, not knocked you out. He he just chased me, but uh, I'm sure he would have took a swing if he thought he could have had a chance to do it. But uh, yeah, that was cowardly, dude. He just like sucker punched you. Yeah, I don't even think he is like part of the protests. <laughs> I don't know, man. There's a, have you seen the videos of it? Um, the, they call him a clown something. Uh, it's on MK on yeah, uh, YouTube. Did. Yeah. I don't believe it though. Cause I, uh, I just didn't look like the same guy to me. The, the mugshot? Yeah. Cause I went through their mugshots too to find out who it was. Like, I'm not going to report him to the cops, but I'm fucking beat his ass next time I see him. <laughs> I thought it was crazy. <laughs> he was wearing that same sweatshirt. I know. Yeah. And no block. Mark. The what? No, no ball of quava, no oh. hat, no hood. We had a mask on, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, dude. I don't, I don't, I thought that was uh, messed up, dude. You should, you didn't deserve that. So just because uh, you think something different me doesn't mean I think you, I, I want you to get beat up. Yeah, wow. It's interesting meeting you. What, what was your stream name again? Uh, Dak is back. Dak is back. Yeah. I saw that stream and everybody sent it to me like crazy. Hey, isn't this him? Isn't this him? Yeah. They yeah. did. Yeah. That was funny. There was um, there was my stream, and then there's a guy like a block and a half down who like captured me getting hit, and I just like, I just went down. <laughs> yeah, he he sucker punched you hard, man. Dude, I, get... I, I mean, I didn't lose consciousness, but I definitely lost. Probably yeah. Control Don't worry about that, man. It, all all it takes, ground, it know? doesn't even take a hard punch. You just got to get hit like right in the jaw, right in the temple, and then your lights out for like a split second and right back up. Lord. So 
The dude was a coward, dude. If you sucker punch somebody, that's a sign of a coward. I know, it's fucking pissing me off. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah, well, uh, I'm glad to, uh, <laughs> glad to see that uh, you're, you're up walking around and still going at it, man. I haven't seen him since. Yeah. Yeah, my chat calls him in, uh, like, King Anarchy. Yeah. <laughs> he's not that big, actually. He's, he's not that big of a guy. Oh, no. He's a complete crackhead. Yeah. She's holding the cat like this. All right, man. Nice the, to meet you. Uh, Glad to see you uh, weren't uh, messed up by that punch. So. Holding it there and then throws the cat. What brings you out here, man? What do you say? What brings you over here? Uh, oh well, there there is a. You know why I'm here. They they put that uh, flyer out. I was pretty much thought it was a, a troll, but I figured I'd come out here and see the tree. And if it wasn't a troll, then I'd film something. So. But you did say there was a protest going on, though, right? A peaceful one. Yeah, at the zoo. At the zoo? Yeah. Where in the zoo? It's the only place they can go is the parking lot. Uh, by the elevators. So the is parking it, what's lot. It, what's it in honor of? Are you Antifa? Pretty good. Pretty good. That's the guy that got uh, knocked out by the, the Miami guy that chased me in Portland uh, with a gang of Antifa that day in June. Which guy? Uh, the streamer right there. He's Antifa though. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he got knocked out by... By uh, a guy came up, sucker punched him. We were, we, we, were, uh, we were listening to his live stream. I'm like, I want to go say hi to him. <laughs> he, he was looking for chuds. I'm like, oh, let's yeah. go find, let's go get him some chuds. I want to see them try to take this tree down. <laughs> I'm wondering what it's anchored to. I don't know. I just I'm trying to find the truck. There's gonna be a truck powerful enough Oops. to howdy, take howdy. it down. I'm gonna go pet this dog. Car. I'll be right back. No. Hey man, can I pet your dog? Sure. What kind? Of, what's his name? Gator. Gator. That's a good dog name. <laughs> Are you sure who likes dogs? Is he Lab and Pitbull? Uh, Pitbull Terrier. Pitbull Terrier. Oh, it's a good boy, Gator. Oh, get you some butt scratches. Oh. <laughs> I'm I'm addicted to dogs, man. I've been trying to like the last couple months. Every time I see a dog, stop and pet it. Yeah. It's uh, it's it's good therapy, man. It makes my life better. Yeah. Dogs are awesome. Oh, it's a good boy. He did a shake. He's still a pupper, huh? Yeah, seven months. He's gonna be a big one. Pretty big. <laughs> you know how big he's supposed to get? Uh, they say up to 20, 22 inches. Yeah. High. Yeah. Dude, but it looks like he's already reached dogs. that, so I don't know. Yeah. With their hands, he might be. He might be a giant of that breed. Thanks, man. Yeah, no problem. You have a good night. Huh? What up, dude? How you doing? I got a decent hug now. You got a hug? Good, bro. How much, dude? Good to see you. Yeah, I think. Good to see you, too. I'm just scared the shit out of Richard. That was pretty entertaining. I'm the one that's supposed to be scared. <laughs> I had this guy all jacked up with uh, gear on him and bear mace was all I could see. Like and I was like, he's just seeing him staring at me out of the corner of his eye, just like and making himself present. They were wondering how I knew it was you. I'm like, I already know where Bella would be here. Uh, well, I'm really curious if they're actually over there because I can just call up the, in, the, in, the entire operations director there and they'll shut that place down quick. Uh, and they'll have like SWAT and everything inside. An animal le goes an inch outside Side there. Well, Habitat, they, they got, get trained. They got tigers, they're pretty hungry. Oh, yeah. There's tigers, lions, hyenas, cheetahs. And I, I, I'm saying, if they let they let a, a gorilla out, I'm just going to stand there and video and record them getting their ass beat by a do we have gorilla. Do we have a gorilla at the zoo? Uh, I believe so. I don't know if it's came back yet. Huh. It's not Harambe. Harambe? Long live Harambe. <laughs> Didn't they kill Harambe? Yeah, Harambe was killed. But he wasn't here. Long live Harambe. Moon's a lot higher tonight than it was last night. <laughs> the what? He's back. Ah. You want me to run him out buddy. this time? Is that a Elisa? I don't know. Alizar? Revolution yeah. Daddy? Yeah. It's okay. We got the real media here. <laughs> Uh, 
the, I think that's Revolution Daddy on Twitter. R3V Revolution Daddy. I think, I don't know. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. Make the Yuletide gale. That's all. You gotta pay for the rest. I'm gonna go find a Viking dog now that I found the gator dog and a Dale dog. I like to sing. I like to sing. Do, 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 do. I think she has a crush on Patriot Prayer. Ah. Are you Revolution Daddy? No? All right, I see more people starting to show up. Security guards coming up to me. Uh, the handicapped guy went and got them for something. Because I have he he five, said that? I have five eyewitnesses that I have not spoke to him once. That's not true. They, they walked up and he walked straight to you guys. I saw it. They walked in together and he walked in straight to you guys. If anything, he was more of harassing those four individuals right there than me. And you guys can check your cameras. I did not speak to him except for saying hi, Richard. And acknowledging that they were he was here. Richard, are they telling you to go tell lies? Antifa showing up. Yeah, more and more Antifa showing up. About two, four, six, eight possibly here now, at least. At least eight Antifa showing up. Yeah, 
Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This guy I recognize. He's always at these events, so I'm gonna count him. A couple other guys that were circling around. I saw so there's at least eight of them here right now. I have a sweatshirt with his name on it. I mean, oh, Michael Ryan Hall, the sweatshirt. Hi. Desperate, do you have to be? Is this girl in the uh, the tights and the boots, is that the girl that got tackled by the police in the yellow jacket like sure. a year ago? You want to see, like, say cheese or something, bro? No, it's not so it doesn't change anything. Well, we're, we're just friendly. No, we're just friendly. It's not a They're not friendly. I didn't know that was a girl. I don't know. I didn't look like a girl of me into the guy. Yeah. Nothing in tights. Yeah. 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 Are they going to see me? I don't know, ask Antifa. Apparently, they got trucks big enough to take us down. So we're here for the snow, not getting one. That's so they feel more comfortable. I'll put the pin back in. I'm going to do that. It's sad that they make uh, did, did Richard go wild. You live. every single thing that was said to him, right? Well, he's also a mess. And uh, he's mentally retarded. I've been walking around, so I don't know how much. Yeah, but everything that, that was said to him by me. To you were right Richard? Over when he came over. All yeah. I did is tell Audra that Richard's here. And then I said, hey, Richard. Yeah, what he said, he went and told him he slapped him. No, I pulled him. I threatened to stab him. Oh, uh, yeah, that didn't happen. I don't happen. make threats. I, I just do. That didn't happen. Because I learned that the hard way. You don't say you're going to do something, you just do it. Or you say it as you're in, in the act. More showing up. We probably got a dozen Antifa here now, so. At least. Lots of cars are showing up and driving, circling. people coming here and it makes me think that something's happening over there. Let's step over this way just so I can see the tree on my stream. Was oh, that just your background for them? Yeah, there's nothing to point at right now, so. I, it's on, I'm on live stream, you, so everything you say is on live stream. Oh, 
there's like 14 plus Antifa here. All over the, the square. Yeah, so some over four, the 14 yeah. that are easy to count, so probably, probably more. safe to say 20 to 25 at least. Yeah, and then in the surrounding blocks too. So I'll take this time to do my post, my plug. So if you guys don't watch me regularly, you're watching the Villain Report on YouTube live right now. You can also follow me on Facebook, you, uh, Villain Report. I am on a 30 day ban right now on Facebook, but I think you can still follow me. And uh, once I get released from jail there, I'll start posting on there again. Twitter is one of the most active places I post. That is Villain Report. I also have Parlor now. Not sure what I think about Parlor yet. That's Villain Report. And I have Twitch, and um, I, I believe that one's called Villain Report. And I will have some more platforms soon. Uh, if you guys want to help out uh, my endeavor into reporting on the ground and streaming and showing you guys firsthand what happens at certain events, you can hit me up at Cash App, Villain Report, Venmo, Villain Report, and also the Villain Report at gmail.com for PayPal. PayPal is the villain port at gmail.com. Thank you all for all your support. Thank you for my mods that are in here and help me out continually, keeping me from getting trolls in, out of here. Uh, I really appreciate you guys. Appreciate all the intel and support and encouragement you guys have given me the last couple months. Isn't this Christmas tree beautiful? I'm really enjoying it today. <laughs> You, you guys want to... We're cheering you guys on. I'm going to go down there and see what they're doing. You want to come or you stay up here? It's kind of sad that you see the families that are here having fun, starting to look around and notice, like, ah, maybe we need to take the kids home, so... That's sad. Oh, it looks like they bought this gentleman some shoes. That's nice. Curious about how they have this tree anchored. Got a big steel beam coming up from the ground there. There's another one there. I don't know about you guys, but I want to go back to our peaceful, safe society where people don't go around terrorizing and trying to scare people. I believe Audra's group bought this gentleman a pair of shoes. guy doing some interpretive dance over there. <laughs> I'm gonna check this guy out. Good miming there. I don't know how he's not cold right now. It's 
like 40 degrees right now, I think. Maybe, maybe dipping. Looking good, man. What a crummy thing for a group of people to do to come terrorize the, the city Christmas tree. <laughs> That's nice. Got him some good socks and some boots. You see he's barefoot running around in winter. Yeah, those are the those are the good socks. I said those are the good socks. Those are nice nice socks. Those are the thick socks. They're the good ones. Oh yeah. Yeah. Are they going on your feet? I don't know. So nice out. I remember I used to love walking down in uh, December, just taking walks downtown, getting hot chocolate, walking around the tree, walking around the other areas that have lights up. Let's go, I'm gonna go see if they have the, uh, the beavers, if they knitted the beavers some sweaters this year. Hopefully they did. If you're not from Portland, um, certain things about Portland that are weird are actually kind of cool. A lot of them are just like uh, uh, homeless drug people on the street. That's the typical weird, or that ugly statue off in the distance over there. Go look at that in a minute. Maybe I won't, it's ugly. But uh, I've got these, uh, I think this is the side the beavers are on. Yeah, this is the side. Uh -uh, it doesn't look like they don't have any sweaters yet. Shame, shame, you Portland knitters. You're not on your game this year. And then again, I can understand why people wouldn't want to come downtown this year. So, got these fountains here and all around the, the Pioneer Square Courthouse. And they have different animal statues in each one. This one's the beavers. They usually, in the wintertime, somebody comes down and knits sweaters onto them. So, usually all these guys are covered in sweaters right now. So, it's going to be a cold winter for them this year. There's another one over there I didn't see. And then there's the sea lions down there and they usually knit, knit stuff on the end too. Phoenix Dak is back. Set that trick up about letting the zoo animals out for you to get you all fall for it. I don't know. gonna be able to tell every time someone lies to you so just gotta figure it out like i didn't think any antifa were gonna show up to this today i thought it was complete uh complete troll but figured like what's the worst that happened i come down here and film and they're here and i get to film something interesting or they don't show up and i get to hang out and look at the christmas tree for a while i already pet a doggo so it's a win for me tonight Oh well, that can do what he wants to do. Dak, I, if you're watching my stream, I guess you're stalking me and telling everybody where I'm at. Kind of a weaselly thing to do. We talked face to face. If you had a issue, you could have brought it up then, man. Yeah, that was really nice of them. Go buy that man a pair of shoes, man. Keep him from getting frostbite or or a cut or something that might have got him pretty messed up this winter. 
That's pretty nice of them. We got otters here. The otters don't have any any sweaters on them this year either. You guys, you knitters in my in my my Portland knitters that are watching this stream, get on your game. These statues need the the Portland weird sweaters on them. Must happen. I always like seeing those weird sweaters. Some ducks. Little bear cubs and a rainier and the mama bear eating a salmon. None of the statues have sweaters like they're supposed to. It's a, it's a tradition. It's a Portland tradition. Can't stop our holiday traditions just because the apocalypse is coming. Got to be like the guys on the Titanic and play the violin all the way down. All the way down. teenagers out here right now a couple dozen teenagers non-antifa teenagers gentleman up there gave me the ones uh, the one up he gave me the number one sign I'm number one they call me a Trump streamer I think I said F you Trump streamer It kind of stinks, man. There's so many people out here that just want to enjoy the tree. And they're all, like, up on the outskirts. Granted, a lot of them are troublesome teenagers. I asked him a while ago if he can just like chill on the COVID like bashing and everything because I had a family member pass from it. Yeah. And that was before I knew you guys. And he's like, nah. You guys are back. What's up, man? We yeah. are. Good to see you. Yeah. yeah. We're so violent so that we threaten people. Okay. No, I, I know this. I spoke with him yesterday. Yeah. 
How are you doing, Jake? Good. Got uh, behind Amy Lyons again here today. I met him for the first time up in Washington earlier today. I didn't know he was such a homie. Uh, yeah, I think he said homie like 10 times and just ready to just roll down with people, aren't you? I mean, down for the cause. Yeah. I'm just uh, <laughs> super passionate about this shit, man. Yeah. Like tonight, I'm just down here fucking hanging out. Well, I think I'm going to be the next one. They call it no and life. I, feel I like call that's it what, that's uh, caring about your country. Yeah. Who cares what they say? They they throw painted old ladies and, yeah. and beat up weak people. I know. I don't think do they you, do. Do you live here. around here? Is that why you're down here? Or you um, use curtains, though? I actually am like in transitory right now. I'm I'm gonna go spend some time in Florida, so I don't live anywhere permanently right now. Do you need a place to crash? No, I'm good. Thanks, bro. Right. Yeah. My place is nice and warm. Thanks, man. Good. You got a roof you can back. use in my living room. <laughs> right on, man. I got a, I got a, I got set up. I just bought a mini projector that's like this big, and I, I have it aimed at my ceiling, and I'm watching Naruto swoop it in on my ceiling. Yeah. Naruto. Oh, okay. Naruto. So I'm just sitting, laying in bed, just. But no, no, I saw. Own speaker and it's Bluetooth as well. I heard what was potentially going down, I figure. If it didn't go down, I'd just hang out at the tree. And if well, it did I go down, I'll film. I, I knew that that wasn't going down. Just because I'm in the living room. <laughs> yeah, it was kind of a nonsense post. Well, it, I mean, the logistics behind removing a tree and yeah. that's that size and putting it into a car is just not... I kind of wonder what they have it... down here for that. kind of have it, wonder what they have it anchored with. It's got to have, like, some, like, oh, I'm crane sure. weights or something. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. A couple... Probably tens of thousands of brick weights under there. Concrete yeah, blocks. They just freestanding. I wondered if they drilled something in the ground and it's sitting in the ground. I mean, I don't know, bro. Probably. Like you think, if it's that tall, it's probably gonna have some anchor into the ground. Or maybe it's just it's just a giant version of your home Christmas tree holder under there. That's all it is. Right. I know, I like it. <laughs> it's got the screws, the the eye screws that they. <laughs> that would be cool. I'd probably get upset with you if you did that, though. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, I can't be hanging around us. <laughs> I think. I got this girl, she's 110 pounds. Would you guys have ever guessed, like a year ago, that there'd, there'd be a gang of ninjas hanging out in the Pioneer Square, uh, trying to harass people at the tree for Christmas? Yeah, I thought so too, Dari. I thought it was just a nice little simple thing they did. It made it, made it a little bit more festive. I like Christmas stuff. I'm not the kind of guy that like sets that stuff up. So my, my place always looks like a bachelor place. But uh, it's nice when there's a woman around that puts a woman's touch on things. It's always nice. I don't know if I know any Christmas carols from start to finish. I know like a, like a stanza of, of, um, of different ones. I like the tree this year. Even the Grinch couldn't steal Christmas.
Well, it's win-win either way. If they don't mess the tree up, then we got the tree. If they do mess the tree up, they have literally become the Grinch that stole Christmas, and that's what they'll be forever known as, and there will be no more possible way for them to spin themselves. Like, nobody likes, nobody likes the Grinch. Nobody wants Christmas to be stolen. I don't watch streams, so I haven't seen it, but if you've seen um, things that go against terms of service, like threats or stalking or that kind of thing, that might be something you might want to report. I think that's completely reasonable. Dude, the guy that sings the electric guitar Grinch song, that is my favorite Christmas song. You're a mean one, Mr. Grinch. Yeah, that's Jake over there. Jake, Jake, Jake behind enemy lines. Chrysanthemum, do you like the sparkle, the sparkle lights? The uh, fire department hazard truck out here tonight. They are constantly responding to places all over downtown for um, indigent is that the right word or disabled and and um needy people that live in the housing downtown that uh, constantly find themselves in medical conditions or um drug conditions quite a lot somebody post that uh Send me a DM or post that, uh, that Grinch rock and roll song for me uh, so I don't have to look it up when I get done with the stream. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to rock out. I'm going to get some hot chocolate and rock out to that later after this. Get my spirits going. I got the tree going. Uh, happy good times. I'm going to get some hot chocolate and listen to my favorite Grinch Christmas song. You're a mean one, Mr. Grinch. Every solitary inch. Yeah, I knew you knew you like the sparkle chrysanthemum. It's that uh, homeless man that they bought shoes for. He's the one that's screaming. Yeah, I don't know his name. I'm, I haven't been involved in that. I think they've been interacting with him a little bit from what I've heard. So. Do, 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 do. Oh, they just, there, there's a silly, a silly flyer going around on the internet saying that like, uh, no justice, no tree. <laughs> and uh, it looked it looked like a I, di I didn't think anybody was going to come out I thought it was just a troll but uh, they're out here they're out here and apparently there's a a couple more dozen around the block somewhere look at that pupper did I already pet him? I'm going to try to pet him 
Can I can I pet your pupper? Yeah. What's his name? Her name's Brownie. Brownie? Oh, hello. You're a lover dog, aren't you? There's so much going on over there, huh? There's so much things to smell and bite. <laughs> Thank you. You guys have a good night. Brownie. All right, what is my favorite building here? I'm pretty partial to the Pioneer Courthouse, Pioneer Square, Pioneer Courthouse. Um, they don't light it up though. They keep it all dark because of all the, the darkness that's come over Portland. But uh, I believe in the past they put Christmas tree lights up on this thing. They've got wreaths, wreaths up at least, wreaths up. You know, one thing I've been appreciative in downtown Portland is businesses that take the time to just add a little splash of black and paint the cardboard that's covering up all the windows black. Ooh, it just brings the, the atmosphere of the city up a couple levels. It's the little things in life, the little touches that make everything better. go see where the peeps are going but uh i was gonna say what i think that building's my favorite it's like old timey like christmas movie downtown new york kind of feel to it i gotta see rockers uh rockefeller yeah rockefeller center for the first time when i went to new york this year that was cool um they had a big giant covid mask on the uh the whatever that god's name is um the statue i thought that was lame <laughs> took a lot of the essence away See, now this building over here chose to paint their, their, their plywood gray, like a white gray. I don't think it added to it. I, I, I prefer the, uh, the plywood, plain plywood, but uh, the black, that's, that's lovely. Who's that one guy who said, I'll be back? What up, what up? Audrey, do you sing any Christmas songs? If you face the little trees with the big tree behind you, he would be on your left. Okay, yeah, so you're right. He was on the other side. Because you were faced that way. Who cares? Let them do what they're going to do. That's Brownie. Of course you know the dog. Of course, of course I know the dog. I've already pet you, pet him. I beat you to it. It's a, it's a girl. Would you expect any less of me? Is that, is that Michael up there that they're surrounding?
Oh, this is a liar. Right? Did you not bring it out for doing a damage? You fucking liar. This is the thing where he does shit. Yeah, that's all good. He pulled the horn dog. He pulled the horn dog. He fucking liar. Hey, the cheetahs are out. The cheetahs at the zoo. The cheetahs! Why aren't you rescuing the cheetahs? Hey, that gun ain't doing you no good without equipment. This is the master. Mine has equipment. What's up, dude? Hey, 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 hey,
you guys get me on karaoke and I can do a mean Say It Ain't So by Weezer. Oh, Antifa just like doubled up there just now. I'll practice it and record one and put it out for Christmas maybe. No promises, I'm not gonna do it. Thanks, Rona. Nice voice. Get a sing along. Going to chase the scumbags away. Be nice. They're so juvenile. All their little uh, chants they do. Look, these are these are adults saying this. These are adults up here saying this. taking it down. Ah. Yeah. I've been attempting to serenade people with uh, Christmas songs, but I don't know more than like one or two lines of Christmas songs. <laughs> I pulled the I pulled the lyrics out of my phone, but I just don't know the whole songs. Antifa Press here. The Asian dude. Roxanne, $20 super chat. Thanks for being you. Thank you, thank you. Is it the same Roxanne? No. <laughs> Thanks, Roxanne. Merry Christmas. Yeah. DB, what's up, DB? Has his shirt and tie always been painted? Oh, they broke his umbrella. Yeah, and if you look inside it, they put a little jewel. A jewel? Uh. Here you go, stream. Here's your diamond. Um, it's, um, I'm selling it for $100,000. <laughs> Okay, this is, it goes to the Alan Sweeney Fund. <laughs> it's, it'll be right here if you guys want it. Just leave the money here and let me know. <laughs> um, I, if I say your, your name wrong, I'm sorry. Rumpli, Rumpli, Rumpli. Uh, thanks for a $10 super chat. Thanks for doing what you do. Merry Christmas. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, the Antifa Antifa crowd's getting, getting larger. They, uh, it's about half the size they had when they were against me over there. I agree. The Nazis should go home, those jerks. American flag with the umbrella used to be. That'd be a good idea. What are you even doing here? <laughs> I could do it too. Howdy, Faith. Oh, call me Zoolander. Zoolander, just go. I'd like to be called Zoolander. Are there Nazis here? They should definitely go home. Yes, they are Nazis because they oppose people's uh, freedom of speech and they also have interfered in elections. Those are two things that classify Nazis. Yeah. And I don't think any patriots have done that. DK, thanks for the super chat. I saw that. Thank you. The the election counts being 
um, certified with Biden women. I don't know who DK is, so it sounds like you guys know who he is. I'm not familiar with that. I don't, I don't really follow streamers. That's weird because I'm a streamer. You think I'd be up on it all, but when I want to see it, I just go out and see it. We've got a, about approaching 50 maybe, nah, maybe 40, 30 to 40 probably. Yeah. 30, 40 to an antifas. DK Records, since the ban on Twitch, I stream on YouTube now. Thanks for the super chat, man. Somebody tell me who DK Records is. It's a Antifa streamer, Patriot streamer. Eat, eat, someone says. Got the freight brokers in the crowd. We are, we are back to the mindless chanting. No thoughts, no words, Black Lives Matter. You gonna bust out and pl sing the rest of that Queen song? You know what? That's the that's the that's the beginning of that Queen song, right? No. Hey yo. Hey yo. Oh, that one, Deo, Deo. Okay. <laughs> Six foot, is? seven foot. Where where did it come from? Uh, where did that song come from? I don't know. Lion King. Hey yo. Okay, and okay. They wanna come, and they wanna go. <laughs> hey that's a good movie, man. The kids watch it. Man, I'm a I'm a cartoon fanatic. You four are? Kids, what, four kids, what the heck? What do you say? One, my youngest one turned, just turned 17. 17? Oh, wow, wow. My, my next one turns 33. 33? Next year. You got a little bre next. breath of uh, distance between them, huh? A little, next, little years between them? Next month. Wow. Well, That's her birthday right there. Christmas is her birthday? Wow. You can't beat me, bro. Yeah? I got a Chinese New Year. My birthday is March 8th. My daughter's birthday is March 9th. Right on. Christmas, like Christmas, Chinese, one day after mine, and Thanksgiving. Right on, man. Well, you have a good night. You do. Oh. 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 Getting this, used to those new boots. They're a little stiff still. Hey -oh. Daylight come and we want to go home. Where's the squad at? They're up there. I can't see, I ain't got my glasses. Ah, all right. Help! Help! <laughs> Beetlejuice. <laughs> uh, that's what I was saying. I was like, I see me in Akuna Matata. Thanks, DK. I see that. Another, another two dollars super chat. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. For those of you that don't know what's going on, I am in downtown Portland, Oregon, at Pioneer Courthouse Square. This is the area where many events happen. That is the Pioneer Courthouse in the background, the historic courthouse. 
Uh, we're surrounded by tall buildings, a mall in the background that is almost out of business. Um, that was before COVID. Uh, most of these build- businesses are all boarded up. But this is an event center um, in downtown Portland. A lot of festivals here happen, um, not so much recently. But this is the 30-some year tradition of the lighting of the Christmas tree. It happened yesterday, the day after Thanksgiving. Uh, it's kind of uh, something Portlanders enjoy a lot. Today, there was some uh, notice that Antifa was going to show up here, and they had a goofy flyer that kind of looked like a troll, but said to come out, look at the tree, and if they came out, they'll film them. If they didn't, they'll film the tree. The, uh, the flyer said, no justice, no tree. So there's about, I don't know, 40-ish, maybe 50 Antifas out here, um, all shouting and heckling people. Um, we've got a handful of patriot types here. Um, they came out and gave that, uh, that shouting homeless man some new shoes and socks. He was barefoot. But uh, we're here. Um, just, I came to film, obviously, but uh, some of the, the self-proclaimed, self-named, uh, what we call the patriot crowd, um, came out to, I don't know, watch and make sure nothing happened to the Christmas tree. Antifa is encroaching on the Patriot crowd more and more. They were to the right of that tent just a little bit ago, and now they're all getting closer and closer to the Patriots. So, if you are new to this channel, I am Villain Report on YouTube. You're watching me live. You can also sign up and follow me on Facebook, which I am in a 30-day jail ban for. I am in Facebook jail for 30 days. Well, you can follow me, and hopefully I'll still have an account after that 30 days. You can follow me where I'm most active on Twitter. That's at Villain Report. You can follow me on Parlor at Villain Report. You can follow me on Twitch, Villain Report. And if you like to help out, uh, keep this kind of independent, I don't know what to call it. I feel uh, I'm not uh, stable enough to call myself a journalist. It's kind of a joke. But I do come out and film these things and try to see things from my eye and let, share that with you. I am trying to get my situation better. Uh, got a website in the making and uh, start putting out written articles and uh, fresh content from that. But uh, you can, uh, if, you, if you do like this sort of thing and you want to help support it, you can uh, hit me up on Cash App at Vill- or Dollar Sign Villain Report, Venmo at Villain Report, and PayPal, the Villain Report at gmail.com if you'd like to help support my endeavors to keep growing this and uh, reporting on the ground as I can. It's been an interesting uh, six, eight months of learning, learning all this stuff and going through everything. Like many of you are going through as well. Look at that. There's a family up there with their dog and their daughter, and they're like, I don't know about this. I came to see the tree. But, uh... We'll be in, De- in uh, D.C. next month, in the middle of December. We'll film some interesting things there. It was interesting today, if you guys got the chance to see my stream, I was up in Washington at the state capitol in Olympia. They had a, uh, a protest against the COVID lockdowns and tyranny of the state officials in Washington. Uh, they ended up marching onto the governor's mansion, which is actually on the state property there. It's just uh, Antifa starting to get uh, intimidatingly close. They're not keeping their distance from the Patriots. This guy here told me to turn around and uh, get my stuff out of the way. He told me to end the winter. You got five miles worth of traffic. Go off the road. You and your people on the thug. Yeah, how you doing? Remember me? You put a face in my face. You put your fucking hands on me. You fucking disrespect all my whole bunch of shirts, bitch. Fuck you. God fucking disrespectful. Security guard's like, oh, I don't know. I don't know if I picked the right job for this. Shining me a light over there. 
No, I know, yeah, he's, he was shining it in my face. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not, I'm not angry. Everybody say it's stopping me, bro. I know that. I was an angry girl for not turning the place upside down. Oh, yeah? Turn the whole place upside down. You know, baby? What place? Where's that at? What place? No, is that a place? Yeah, bro. No. You were the casual of a drive-by egging. A run-by egging, man, that sucks. They threw an egg at that man. I don't think they were aiming at him, but he got hit with it. Why do they always have eggs? Why do they always have eggs? This is a little thing I call fascism and tyranny. Intolerance in the name of tolerance. Fascism in the name of anti-fascism. Oh, uh, Mace is going. Mace is getting sprayed. Oh, someone tried to throw a beer at my face and they missed. You missed me like always. Missed me like always. You're okay, I got you. I got you. We're gonna walk out of here, okay? Just, just try. To... Oh, you gotta lock that on you, man. Step, step, step. I got you, bro. We're just gonna keep walking, okay? Yeah. We're just keep walking, okay? I did water down. We can't get water right now. We're gonna keep walking until we're out of here and safe, okay? Okay, we're gonna turn here. Grab the base. We're gonna keep walking. We're gonna keep walking. Walk a little faster, okay? I got you. You're not gonna trip on anything. It's flat ground, okay? You just gonna have to take the pain, man. I don't have any water for you right now. I'm sorry. I'll get to one of those fountains. Well, if we find one, if I see one, we'll get to it, okay? Okay, you guys, I gotta turn my stream off so that they don't follow me. So I'll check in with you guys in a little bit. I gotta turn the stream off real quick, bud.